Hello guys, so it is back to school season and I remember when I used to go to school or high school in Australia, unfortunately we had to wear uniforms so there was no way of choosing what to wear because we had to all wear the same thing. However, in college we did get to choose what we want to wear. I think most of my time I lived in tracks when I was in college but when I do wanted to look a little bit more presentable, I had to spend quite a lot of time picking out the right outfit. Try not to look overdressed, but then not look like I wasn't trying. Today, I'm gonna have Mia share with you some of her tips on what to wear for back to school, and hopefully you guys will be inspired too. Hey guys, so summer is over and school is starting. Yay! Okay, who am I kidding? That's not what you would normally say. But what can we do? It's back to school season and I remember being half bummed out and half excited about it because you want to look cute and make your first day back as awesome as possible, you know? So I put together three different outfits that will hopefully help cheer you up. Check it out! This first outfit is so easy to create. I took this cropped t-shirt I picked up the other day at Forever 21 and paired it with this super cute skirt from H&M. I think the two pieces help create that whole I'm not trying too hard but I think I look okay vibe. <laughs> And you can also wear sneakers, heels, wedges, whatever you like. But here, I'm wearing my trusty slip-on because they're so comfortable. I've been loving this top or dress or dress top <laughs> with side slits from ASOS since I saw Kendall Jenner wearing something similar before and I think it's great to wear on your first day back at school because you look so chic in it. I love pairing it with my skinny ankle jeans and wedge sandals because for this outfit, I need the height. <laughs> And to avoid looking too sexy for school, go for a mid-rise or a high-rise jeans so you can spend more time listening to your professor in class than fixing your outfit. You know, like what you're supposed to do in school. This last outfit is another comfortable and easy one to pull off because basically, it's a foolproof t-shirt and jeans combo. In this one, I'm taking this graphic tank and pair it with my favorite skinny distressed jeans. Because the graphic tank is kind of loose, I'm going with my skinny jeans instead of a boyfriend jeans so it doesn't look like I'm drowning in my own outfit. The red lace ballet flats add a pop of color enough to make the whole outfit interesting. Oh, and why don't we throw in this light cardigan just in case it gets cold in the classroom, shall we? So what do you think? Which one did you like best? Or what are you going to wear for your first day back at school? Tell us in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And we'll see you next time. Bye!